Welcome to Prep Beat. This is Thomas Lawrence. I'm TJ Holmes, and today we're previewing the West Valley Eagles football team. And Thomas, West Valley's coming off a great season. Eight and three, made the playoffs. They have an electrifying player in running back Austin Clark. He's only a junior, ran for almost 900 yards last year, scored 15 touchdowns. Where does this offense go after he's had a whole year under his belt and he's only a junior? You know, there's only room to grow up. As you mentioned, an amazing year last year. Every time he touched the ball, it seemed like something good happened. Over 10 yards per carry. And, um, you know, Coach Greg Randell told me that when it's all said and done, if Clark stays healthy and does what he can, it, he could be one of the best running backs this section this area has seen in a long time. He's complimented by a junior, Brady Castleman, who's a fullback. Grandel told me he's the guy. He, he catches everything that comes to him, basically. And they're also backed up by a big, really big for high school offensive line. Guys like Derek Knight and Tyler Ward, um, you know, to provide a lot of reinforcement for Clark and Castleman and the new quarterback, Dalton Tracy. And I know that size is there on the defensive side of the ball, too. Yeah, exactly. That defense, that size on defense is really there with their 3-5. You know, all their linebackers average almost 220 pounds each. You know, Brady Castleman playing on the outside. And then Larry Tanner's kind of plugging up those holes in the middle. So, you know, you got those two guys at linebacker. Then you also have Austin Clark roaming back there at free safety. So they got playmakers on the defensive side of the ball as well. And, you know, with 7 out of 11 of their defensive starters or underclassmen, you know, they're young, but they are experienced because some of them did play a lot last year. We're excited. You know, we've done a lot of work, and uh, they've, they've put in the time. Now they got to put it on the field. We got, we're young in a lot of areas, but they are experienced because they had, you know, they played last year. Uh, we like our chances. We, we think we got a good team. We can stay healthy. We got to stay healthy. A depth is a concern, but if we can stay healthy. We should have a good team. And you know, their health is especially important, TJ, considering their schedule was rigorous from beginning to end. They open up on August 24th on the road in Crescent City against Del Norte. They come home for back-to-back -back games against Shasta and Enterprise. Then they go to McClemens and Oakland, and that's all before their tough NAL schedule. Yeah, I mean, when you get to the NAL, you know, they're still facing some tough teams. You know, much improved CV. Wairik is going to be good as well. And then you also have Lassen, who's back in the NAL, and they're always tough. They've always played upper division teams really well, so now they're back in the NAL against D2. So it's going to be a tough road for West Valley. Every game's going to matter. So that's going to do it for the Eagles preview, and make sure to check out prepbeat.com for more high school sports information.